Now when I first came into Rice, it was a, a very different experience. I came in as a very different person. My mom immigrated to the United States from El Salvador. She had me and my siblings here, and unfortunately, my dad uh, was never really in the picture, so it was up to her to take care of us by herself. She works at a car wash, uh, continues to do so to provide for, you know, to provide for me and my siblings. And now I'm at this point in my life where I'll actually be able to make a difference in their lives and, and help them out in, in so many more ways. I started off here at Rice as a chemical engineering student. It's a difficult major. There's a lot of uh, tough courses and things aren't always easy, but there's so many resources on campus that have helped me succeed and have helped me push through tough times and make sure that ultimately I can be successful in what I do. I've been involved in many different organizations here at RISE, the RISE Center for Engineering Leadership, the Door Institute for New Leaders, Society of Hispanic Professional Engineers, and several other volunteering uh, organizations such as DREAM and RISE and Power. I wasn't sure if I if I was going to be successful in, in what I committed here at Rice. I I feel like you know coming from my background like made it difficult at, at certain points and there was times that I struggled. But here I am. You know I'm I'm a senior at one of you know the most prestigious schools in the nation in the world, and and I've made it. Overall, you know, I've, I've had a great time at, at Rice University. I'm excited to, to be here and I'm excited for the opportunities that I've received while I was here. I will be working for Ernst & Young as a consultant after I graduate in May. So I've got a job secured, uh, which is a, a really nice feeling to know that I'll actually be able to achieve, you know, the goals that I came in with and help my family out and help them see, you know, a better future.